Every year, students from Wolverhampton Polytechnic pitch to Paris to raise money for charity. Quand j'étais là, j'ai pesé beaucoup de filles parce que je suis un, un homme typique de, d'Angleterre et j'aimais beaucoup euh, euh, les filles euh, françaises. This has occurred annually for the past five years and occurs during the second term. Et voilà, l'histoire et tout le monde à Paris, bienvenue à H90 R. What follows is the story of 200 Wolves Poly students hitching to Paris. The film is called Hitch 90 R. R, R, R. Well, this is the leaving point just over here on my right. This is where all the uh, crazy students will be leaving from. So get on the coach, be dropped off the motorway, uh, start hitching to Paris. There'll be about four or five coach loads leaving. So this now, half past nine, first one's just left. They'll be leaving four or five coach loads up until midday. And then we're going to follow them, and we're going to catch them up, and see them in all the service stations, and see what their stories are so far. Hitch 90. <laughs> Oh, here we are, we've got a couple of pictures. Where are we going? Where are you going? Um, I don't know. Paris. 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 Yeah, can you read? <coughs> this is, I'm not going with you. <laughs> you two itching together? No. Where are you going with? I don't know. Where are they? Well, one's over there, one's over there. Are they dressed up? Yes. <laughs> Or do you, you went to Paris like before? That. No. Have you been to Paris before? No. What's going to happen to Paris when you get there? It's going to get Sorry, shagged right down. You're going to get what? You're going to get shagged right down. You're going to get shagged right down. There you go, Selwyn. <laughs> With me now is Paulina, Bill, Nikki, Nikki Andy, Andy, Gav, Andy, Gav, Gav, Martin, Martin, Gav, Andy, Gav. Andy, Andy, and Dave again. <laughs> these young, these lovely young ladies are the helpers. There. What are you doing? Taking everybody's names, giving them their ID cards, making sure they get all right on the right coach. So you're doing as well. So what do they do with these ID cards? Well, they hand them in so they can get their passports and things. That's what they do down at Dover. Mm-hmm. We've got helpers down at Dover yeah, as well. Yeah, Mandy and Alex yeah, at Dover. Yeah, We're going to be there all night until 11.56 <laughs> on the last ferry. And then they're getting up for 6 o'clock in the morning. How many people in? <laughs> yeah, quite a few. This is the second coach load going now. Since half eight this morning. Half eight? Yeah. Yeah. Did everyone turn up? 
coach. Um, about five. Two. Two. Okay. Two. Okay. Yeah. Two. <laughs> no. Oh well, they'll miss out on Paris maybe. Maybe not. There's plenty of coaches to come. <laughs> You're not going to get high, are you, on this trip, Johnny? Well, yeah. <laughs> you better come with us then. <laughs> yeah. Who hit you Sick, with? Look, I bought this yesterday, one pound fifty, and the moustache has fallen oh, out already. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Put your hat on, you know. Do you think you're going to get picked up wearing that? Well, I'm hoping to, yeah. Right. It's all about a lift, aren't you? No. <laughs> you're not getting picked up. Who are you itching with? Well, Rebecca. Before. Rebecca, again. Do you, know what she told, do you know what she told us? <laughs> No, tell me. So what are you going to get out of Paris? And she goes, hopefully lots of shots. I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> and the people she picks up or get picked up from. Thanks, Lloyd drivers. Bye. When you're off? You go. Soon, 10.15. 10.15. Where are you going to get dropped off, do you know? No. No idea. No, I don't care, really. I don't right. care. I've got a map. On the motorway. No, I have. How many lifts you out and you'll get to take to get down to Paris? Well, it took me ten last year. Like, why that? <laughs> to get to Dover, yeah. To Dover? Yeah. What about from uh, Calais to Paris? Um, you got the train last year. You cheated? Oh, I'm probably dead, yeah. Do you reckon the chances of cheating again are quite high? Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's hitched 90 for you. <laughs>